Hello YouTube, today I'm going to see how to fix this PC can't run Windows 11. The PC must support TPM 2.0. The PC must support Secure Boot. To fix this, cancel the Windows 11 installation and go back to Windows 10. And you have to do some changes to the BIOS. Follow the steps. First, uh, restart your PC and then go to BIOS settings. For Gigabyte users, you have to use um, delete key. In keyboard and it will go to the BIOS and uh, other users you can check your BIOS uh, hotkey and once you go to BIOS uh, click on BIOS then you have to go to CSM support and click on disable now you can see the secure boot option is here so once you have this one you have to enable this particular secure boot but you will get this error so what you have to do is again go to BIOS and make sure CSM support is disabled then go to save and exit and uh, click on save and exit setup and save the configuration and system will automatically reboot and once the reboot is done just again click on uh, restart and go back to the BIOS settings. So once you are back click on BIOS then you have to go to secure boot and uh, here you have to go and enable this secure boot so now it will allow to enable and uh, secure boot customization keep it as standard or you can also keep it as custom so once this is done again you have to go to save and exit so again you have to save your setup again your system pc or laptop will reboot so once reboot is done again you have to go to restart and uh, go to bios now go to BIOS settings and check that secure boot has been enabled. So once this is done, now we have to enable TPM 2.0. For this, you have to go to Intel Platform Trust Technology and enable it. Similarly, if you are AMD CPU users, you have to go to peripherals and go to AMD CPU FTPM and enable that particular settings. Now click on save and exit and click on save and exit setup so once this is done the system will boot now let us validate secure boot and tpm 2.0 has been enabled i have to go to search and then go to system information and you can see here secure boot state is on so now we have to check tpm so you have to go to search and type tpm.msc and you can see here TPM is ready to use and version 2.0 is enabled. Now you try installing Windows 11. The issue will be solved and you will be able to install Windows 11. Tell me in the comment section below. Give a like and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you.